Uh, hello, everyone. I'm Zheng Quanlu from the University of Science and Technology of China and the Institute of Automation, Chinese Academy of Science. Today's my presentation title is Fed Errors Toward More Accurate and Privacy, Perceiving Errors Recognition via Federated Template Communication. Uh, today's talk is divided into three parts. The first is the motivation. Uh, before introducing our work, I want to briefly introduce the errors recognition. As one famous biometrics method, iris recognition has established a complete system and iris image can be used for training into through collections, IQA segmentations, localizations, normalizations, and enhancement. Then the iris template is obeyed and through the feature extractors. However, traditional feature extraction model training requires the constructions of a centralized iris dataset but it contains a lot amount of personal privacy and high risk of leakage. On the other hand, the distributed application is the current challenge for the promotion of errors. The, er the reason is that the diversity of subject, devices, environment during client brings great heterogeneity resulting in ability to accurately identify. This forced us to think about whether there's a better solutions. Uh, the metric learning is now the common training strategy for areas template extractor model. As the classical model, uh, fed triplet loss drives the same class aggregation and the different classes lived away from each other as a demonstrated in the animation. When the data is uh, dissipated, the triplet law, triplet of one single client may be not be sufficient to continue driving the model to achieve better classification capabilities. But as the animation shows, the negative template transformed from other clients may further support a better training. This process inspired us to build a federated learning framework based on template communications. Uh, then we introduce our method. Before introducing the framework, we first provide more theoretical support for template communication by generalization error bound analysis for simply city. We first uh, we will first discuss this case of introducing templates from one other client where the local client is named target and other clients called source. The edge head is the minimization of a convex combination of errors of the, of the source and target template. Edge star is the minimization of errors on target. W means the Wasserstein distribution distance measurement and the lambda and the theta depend on the template distribution and the selections of hyperparameters. This theorem means that uh, the best generalization error of the target domain with the introduction of the source template performs better than the best hypothesis of the training only on the target template. Then we generalize this, this theorem to a multi-source template introduction. We can get the similar foundations. Uh, further, we generalize the gener generalization error bound with any hypothesis, which is like this. Uh, from this theorem, we get that if the hypothesis space is fixed, the bounder depends on two items. The first is the generalization error of the multi-source template mixture. The second is the distribution distance between the multi-source domains and the target domain. This analysis explains why we need a reweighting in global aggregation. Uh, after having a sounded theoretical foundation, the framework is constructed as shown in this figure. So this training process, the raw iris image and template extractors of each client remains locally untransferred. And only the extracted template are involved into global communication. In order to better transfer knowledge through template communication, two new techniques are proposed as the principle showing in motivation part with the insertion of enough cross-domain negative, negative template by fed traveler, the local inner classes boundary is tightened and the interclass distance is enlarged. The former enhanced the robustness of model generalization and the latter enhanced the distinguishability of local identities. On the other hand, inspired by the foundations, the distribution similarity aggregation is proposed to reveal the heterogeneous distributions the left part applied for scale imbalance, and the right part is employed for distance reweighting. This reweighting aggregation drives the client with more similar, similar templates distributions to contribute more to each other. After building the template communication and FAL framework, 
we perform extensive experimental on some various data set. At first, a group of experiments are conducted verify the influence caused by the introduction of heterogeneous iris tablet. The result shows that the distribution shift between the communication participators may cause this negative transfer for EER performance. So it is unreasonable to train a model on aggregate more data set while ignoring distribution shifts. Uh, then to verify the effectiveness of the proposed method, we conduct many comparative experiments. The result of the model trained by FedSGD and Fed Tablet are close to the result of centralized training, which are much better than the solo training. It verifies the competitiveness of federal template communication. Better is all means that all the clients participate in the communication round, which is much better than federal template. It proves that the rating aggregation significantly mitigate the negative transfer. Besides, federal is all is only slightly inform, inferior to federal iris best, which is the theoretically optimal but unknown before hand in practice. The visualization demonstrated that the Fed Iris successfully reduced interclasses variance and tightened the interclasses distribution when compared with solo and Fed, Fed SGD training. Uh, thank you for uh, thank you for listening. That's all for my presentations.